Hey guys! This is Cartoon Recapped. Today we'll show you a 2011 family adventure cartoon called Kikariki, Team Invincible. Be aware of heavy spoilers. Sit back and enjoy the show. While searching for a place to bury their time capsule, Crash and Chico encounter a cave with the remains of a dinosaur and an old television set. When the cave begins to collapse, Crash and Chico both escape with the set. The duo then demonstrates the television to the rest of their community members. After managing to start it up, the group begins to binge-watch programs, in particular a superhero action show named Lucian, named after the eponymous character who is battling an evil mastermind called Dr. Caligari, who is hellbent on world domination. Believing the events of the show to be real, the group decides to go to the city where the events are apparently occurring and help fight injustice. Wally, who is left back at the island to look after it and turn on the lighthouse, joins them later. On their journey, the group's raft suffers a storm and is severely damaged, but by morning they find themselves in the city's waters and are taken in by the authorities. While in custody, Carlin decides to send one of their own to inform Lucian. Each one of them picks a matchstick, and Wally is eventually deemed as the one who should be sent. The group also realizes that Chico is missing. Meanwhile, Chico wakes up back at the raft and wanders the city's streets. He is eventually taken in by Pin, a museum curator, who allows him to stay until his friends find him. Meanwhile, a series of robberies begins happening around the city. The next morning, Wally escapes the hospital where his fellow group members are prepared to be vaccinated and goes to the channel's TV headquarters, where he encounters Barry, the actor portraying Lucian. Barry then announces his departure from the show to the show's announcer, Boss, who becomes outraged and replaces him with another actor. The whole group, save Chico, encounter Barry, and ask him to help him in their fight against crime, but he denies that he is an actual superhero and tells them to leave him alone. Meanwhile, Chico and Pin are arrested by the police, as Chico has dim-wittingly assisted robbers in stealing items from the museum, causing both to be branded as associates. They are both found guilty and sent to the city's prison, and the group is made aware about this. Crash, Daco, Rosa, Wally, Carlin and Olga visit Barry in his apartment and attempt to convince him to save Chico, referring to him as a fighter for justice. Barry lashes out at them, saying that the whole show and its characters are made up. Wally confirms this to the group, saying that he is simply an actor. Devastated that their whole journey had all been for nothing, the group leaves Barry's apartment. While devising a plan to break Chico out, Barry arrives and tells them to come along with him. He takes the group to the apartment of Eugene, the actor portraying Caligari, whom he convinces to make a real plan for a good deed. Eugene then devises the plan, Daco, who is an electricity expert, and Carlin will go to the sewers underneath the prison and cut the power. Meanwhile Barry, Crash, Wally and Rosa will infiltrate the prison, with the latter two and Olga, who will remain at their getaway van, setting up the zipline for their escape, while Barry and Crash will rescue Chico. The plan goes well at first, and Chico is freed. However, when he insists on breaking Pin out as well, Barry accidentally alerts the security camera guard when he frees Pin by pulling out the door with another door attached by a rope, which crashes into a guard's office and causes him to call for backup. The four flee by lift, but when a lightning strike causes all power to shut down and the lift to begin to plummet, the group escapes through the pipes leading to the roof. Meanwhile, the new show, now called Julian, is broadcast to a live audience, with Boss hosting. After the ad break, a footage is played which reveals that Boss is the one who sent the criminals to go on massive robbing sprees throughout the city, while a stunned Boss and audience watch on. While attempting to zipline from the prison's roof, Barry almost falls to his death when the biplane is cut by a rogue zeppelin, which pursues him to the edge of the roof. Left with no other choice, Barry jumps inside the zeppelin, through its door. The group proceeds to pursue the Zeppelin and their getaway van, but soon end up being pushed by it. Realizing that the van is heading for a cliff, the group evacuates onto the Zeppelin, and in the process Wally almost plummets with the van, but is caught by Rosa. The group then struggles for control of the Zeppelin, but eventually end up seeing their own lighthouse, into which they accidentally crash, sustaining several injuries. The next morning, the group leads Barry to his new house in a wheelchair, towards which he manages to walk on his own. 
Carlin, Daco, Pin, Barry, Crash, Chico, Rosa, Wally and Olga then proceed to photograph all together in front of the house, setting up the events of Kikariki. Thanks for watching. Hope you all enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.